Have you ever wondered if there is something that connects all living things on Earth? DNA, or deoxyribonucleic acid, is a molecule found inside every cell and almost every living thing. DNA is a code which helps cells survive and duplicate. Have you ever extracted DNA from the inside of a cell? If you could extract and stretch a person's DNA, it would be thinner than any hair found on your head. And the DNA from all cells connected end to end could stretch from Earth to the Sun several hundred times. My name is Denise Tapasio Hall, and I'm a scientist here at Thermo Fisher Scientific. Uh, my team and I are focused on next generation sequencing. So, next generation sequencing is a technology that researchers and doctors use to look at DNA molecules uh, to see if there are any mutations that can lead to diseases. So my day-to-day -day here at the lab, I typically start with DNA, which could come as, you know, a tube of DNA from somewhere, or it could have been extracted. And I'll mix that with primers, which are oligonucleotide sequences. So you may have heard of the bases A, T, C, and G. Um, those letters are the codes that are mixed up um, into this tube. And uh, we use that to put on the ends of the DNA and we mix it with some other enzymes and other molecules. We put that in a thermal cycler, which is an instrument that heats it up really high and then it cycles through different temperatures at different times just to replicate the DNA. So you started out with one strand with a few bases and you made more of it. And once we have a large amount of this, it's what we call a sequence, we put that on another instrument and it gives us a result where we can see the codes, the sequences. So some characteristics that help make me a good scientist are having an open mind and not being afraid to fail. So I think I was set on the path to being a scientist as early as first grade. I remember mixing vinegar and baking soda in a bottle, putting a balloon on it and watching it expand. And I thought that was really cool. With that in mind, I went to the University of California, San Diego. I majored, I think I was undeclared when I first went in with the idea that I would do something that could possibly lead me into pharmacy. Um, but I found that as I started taking my classes, Molecular biology and cell biology were really interesting. So in my city, there are about 10,000 other people like me who are scientists in the uh, life sciences field. And here in the country, there are over a million. And, you know, internationally, there are scientists in the U.S., in Canada, in Asia, in Europe. Uh, it's a growing field, so there are jobs everywhere. My name is Denise Tapasio Hall, and I am a scientist for Thermo Fisher Scientific. You could be a scientist too.